So with so much talk at the moment online about players needing to get more open at impact, what I'm actually seeing much more of on the less and tiers, players simply from the top of the swing just spinning the shoulders like crazy, throwing the club out and over and then just wiping across the golf ball with a path that's way too much to the left to be remotely functional when you're trying to hit a golf ball. So we've got two drills for you to do today if you feel like this is something that you suffer with. Going to need your impact bag and just an aim stick. And the first one, what I'd like you to do is just address the, the impact bag, normal grip on the aim stick, up to the top of the swing. And I really want you just to make some swings whereby you feel like you're keeping your back facing the target for about as long as you feel like you can on the way down. Now, if you've been a bit of a spinner, this is really going to feel quite different too. So I want to see you keep your back facing the target, swing your arms down and get into that impact bag. And you'll notice as I'm doing this, shoulders square to slightly close but the hips actually beginning to open up on their own this is the thing the hips are going to tend to get fairly open or certainly open enough for you to be able to deliver the club to the ball on the inside pretty much on their own the important thing is not trying to go too crazy and too early with it where we sling the club out and over so drill number one top of the swing you're going to keep your back facing the target for as long as you can swing your arms down and into that impact bag second one left hand only on the club Dress the impact bag up to the top of the swing. Your job here is to keep for the right-handed player your right shoulder as passive as you can while getting some speed in this left arm. Okay, again. Now you can hear that. I'm going to create some speed by just doing that. It's not a pulling motion and really spinning this left shoulder. So drill number two, get to the top of the swing. Right shoulder stays nice and passive. Get some speed in that left arm on the way down. If you can do this with the impact bag, I like the impact bag stuff. Uh, with the aim sticks because then you're not just simply trying to bash the, the cover off the front of the impact bag but those two drills are really going to help you if you feel like you're a little bit of a spinner from the top of the swing.